to another video. Well, today we are going to do this fancy, beautiful look. <laughs> this amazing look that I did. And I also actually represented some products I have been using. And if you guys are actually really interested, keep watching this. Um, but yeah, and I'm sorry that I haven't been uploading lately. I have been really hella busy. I'm not even lying to you guys. I've been working a lot. And my schedule is just all messed up for the timing of doing a video. And since I have a day off today, I decided to get up. You know, even instead of resting, I decided to get up and do a video for you guys. Because I actually want to keep doing videos because I actually really like them. Okay, so. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. I know it's been like two weeks. <laughs> but anyways, I'm back better than ever. How do they do it? Like, I'm back better than ever. Something like that. My energy right now is like. So, because I had coffee. And now I'm all jittery and stuff, so if you guys can't handle my energy, you know, get up, move around, get my energy, have that energy level. This is what I want you guys to do today. Get up and do something that you have never done before, if you can. Don't do anything crazy. Just something, like, simple. Like, uh, trying new food, doing a new hairstyle, trying a new makeup look, something, something like that. Uh, beating a game. <laughs> I just want you guys to feel motivated throughout quarantine. I also did an Instagram account that um, is going to include like the fitness that I do, the supplements that I take, and everything. I just ordered some supplements that I actually do want to take, and now that I have the money for it, I'm actually going to take that. I'm actually not that. I ordered some supplements that I have been taking for a little bit, and I ran out, but I ordered some, so I'll show you guys on that account. I just wanted to make a separate fitness account because I don't want everything like jammed up in one account. I mean, I don't mind it. I just rather have one account that's makeup and fashion and one account that's just fitness. So, whoa, <laughs> I almost dropped my phone. Since I can do all three, um, I, can't, I can't promise you guys that I'm going to post on the daily about the fitness. But I will post like most likely like the food that I'll eat, like fast food options, like the healthy kind you know and all that since yeah we're in quarantine i guess you can say still but <laughs> i really don't know so if you guys are actually looking like into that just go on my fitness account it's actually called susan v fit and i hope you guys actually follow the account and follow me on what i'm doing and stuff for my fitness and i actually uploaded a leg and booty workout on instagram and i didn't think of the separate account till after like two hours later and i was like you know what i should do a separate account because it's like oh excuse me because it's like you know i feel like it's just going to be easier for me to know which where like not which where just to like have one app that's all about fitness and have one one app <laughs> to have one account that is all about fitness and one account that's makeup and fashion so i know it, it can kind of seem like kind of like annoying i guess you can say but it's like honestly it's gonna be better at the end of the day just you know just to keep up with the fitness if you want to keep up with it or the makeup and fashion either one you guys can follow both i don't really get mind <laughs> but yeah i just wanted to do something you know like now like you know some some of you like that i've known before that i'm sometimes i don't remember and, and i'm sorry that i don't some of the people that i don't remember and i'm sorry that i don't actually remember you sometimes i just don't really remember stuff like that people like that names i'm really bad at that but yeah um some of you guys asked me like how did i get the body shape or how did i get this you know what it's all about like consistency motivation and if you guys don't have motivation at home or anywhere let me be your motivation because i will gladly be your motivation i actually really want to be inspiring someone i don't want to impress i actually just want to inspire and you know i just yeah so let me be your inspiration like right now my energy level is really high, so let me be your inspiration about that, and you're going to see it throughout the video. Oh, that bird is- why is that bird always there? I have been literally doing the makeup video too, and the bird is just watching me. Oh, but anyways, yeah, so I actually hope you guys enjoy this video. Watch it till the end, trust me, because I'm literally going to show you some stuff, and yeah, so thank you guys, and... Let's just get on with the video. <laughs> Foundation, and you guys, I ordered a Urban. No, I ordered an Anastasia Beverly Hills 
foundation and I can't wait for that to come. I've been wanting that foundation for so long and now that I finally got paid, I obviously spend my money on makeup. <laughs> I mean, who doesn't? But you know, I got paid and a girl is waiting for that foundation. And I also ordered a Tatcha dry skin cream because naturally my skin is really fucked up and dry and you know i can't really do anything about that so i heard tatcha was good for that and i spent about 100 bucks for the tatcha thing because they're not cheap but i feel like i know it's worth it and you know my skin is totally worth any kind of money because you know skin is skin you gotta protect that skin you guys, I, I'm in need for like a tan. Like, I want to get a tan. Like, I feel that if I get a tan, I would like look like much better. But, you know, <laughs> I mean, I'm not saying like fair skin is like the worst. I'm just like, I just want to try something new, you know? And I just want to try a tan. And I've been looking at videos of like self tanning, like, you know, those things that. You don't even need to go outside and wait like an hour or two just to freaking tan. You know, I saw like this video about like self tanning. So I probably might do that. Who knows if I'm not lazy. <laughs> so I'm just going to apply a little more foundation. You know, cover everything. Cover those freaking eye bags. No, I'm just kidding. Cover every single thing that I have on my face. And you know, today I have a day off. So that's what's really good that I have a day off today so I have time to make this video for you guys because I was like you know what I really do want to be lazy but you know I'm gonna get up and I'm gonna do a video for you guys because I want to entertain you guys while we're still I guess I don't know are we still in quarantine I can't really tell it's confusing as shit but you know I just want to entertain you guys and I miss you guys I miss talking to you guys even though you can't I can't really talk to you in person, but I know you guys are watching, so yeah. <laughs> so I'm just going to apply the Elf Cosmetics Concealer like I have always done, and I'm just going to blend it out now. And you know, I really love this concealer because it literally covers everything, and I've never used an Elf Cosmetics Concealer, so I'm actually really impressed with the way it works. Like, um... It actually really covers, like, if I, like, let's say, like, if I go to work, if I go to work, I do put makeup on, but not as much, because, you know, I'm still wearing a mask, so who's going to see, like, my contour, my highlight and stuff? So, it's like, I necessarily don't put too much makeup, but this concealer actually really does help a lot and cover. Like, let's say, like, if I don't get enough sleep and you can see my freaking eye bags and stuff, like, it literally does cover, so that's the good thing. And I just cover, like, mostly, like, my my under eye bags i don't have any right now because i slept in a little bit i woke up at 8 30 and i slept like around 12 or 11 somewhere around there but yeah so the next i'm going to be using the fenty beauty contour and i am in love with this one i love fenty beauty so so much i really 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 do because like i've never okay so for a long time, I have been wanting a freaking contour. I just don't know which one that I wanted. Didn't I bring my brushes down? Oh my god. I am literally losing my mind. So, some of you guys use sponges. I mean, I don't, I, okay. I sometimes use sponges for my contour. Not really. But, I'm going to be using the e.l.f. Cosmetics brush and i'm just gonna blend it in like this i used to use sponges for my contour but it never necessarily looked right until i started using brushes or i just wasn't doing it right probably and it, that's most likely <laughs> but um i don't know i feel like using the brush is better for me obviously we have do i have a scratch on my nose i wait oh my god oh no i don't i'm tripping but no um yeah, I just necessarily like the brush better because I feel like it just blends everything better in. And now that my nose is contoured, I feel like like a plastic surgery bitch after. <laughs> like I feel like I feel like after I contour, I feel like I have like something done on my face, you know? 
and I don't know I don't know I just feel that way I, I don't know if it's like I don't know if it's that for like you guys I feel like that like every time I do like my contour like my teeth or my nose I feel like that but you know I'm tripping <laughs> okay so next is obviously blush I was gonna contour my cheeks but I don't really necessarily feel like I should so I'm just gonna apply some blush on instead and I'm going to be using the Ciate London blush and I'm also going to order a new blush too because I mean I love Ciate London don't get me wrong it's actually a very good blush and product that I use but it's like I want to try other things you know like kind of like with the clothing you want to try different brands also with makeup you know haircuts and stuff kind of like that but yeah so I'm just going to be using this brush right here going to smile a little bit and just round it out like this blend it like this just round it out more guys so i have i don't know what kind of skin i actually really have i think like fair skin like i'm not that like pale pale but i'm pale so i apply a little more blush so i don't look so pale in pictures and you know i don't mind putting so much blood well <laughs> i don't mind putting so much blush on and when i was like in junior high i think or high school i think around both I used to um I used to not wear blush because I was scared that I'd be looking like a clown. But the only that's what sucked though, cause nobody told me anything. Literally not even my mom. Like I would apply blush, but I would take it off because I'll be like, no 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 no. I'm gonna look like a clown or no I'm gonna be looking like strawberry shortcake over here with those red freaking cheeks. But no. I actually don't look like that so they were like no you look better with blush on because if I just had I only wore foundation and mascara and you know it wasn't pretty <laughs> it wasn't so like for I think for like half a year I wore like that I think in junior high but <sighs> gosh cuz I hated sorry guys um yeah I hated that that look like I look back and I'm just like why didn't nobody tell me this like are my friends that are my friends today actually my real friends because they didn't tell me shit and I was like but I mean I mean I guess ugh, I guess they are let's just say that oh my god I have so much energy today if you guys are laying down right now in bed or something or just chilling my energy level is on the roof so get prepared for that I know I should have said it probably in the beginning but I had like a big cup of coffee from Starbucks and now I'm like all jittery and stuff <laughs> but you know I hope to make this video fucking bomb as fuck oh my god I'm doing video okay so next I'm gonna be using the Opera Cosmetics highlight which is also hella good I kinda I think I prefer having highlight on my nose right my brother is literally playing his game and he literally only plays his game when I'm literally doing a video why why is it always like that like every time I want to do a video he's playing and I'm just like dude I literally need like a room that's far away from him when he's playing because he's so loud like I'm not even kidding like ugh. you can literally hear him outside from the window that's literally shut <laughs> so I'm gonna be using this palette and the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to apply this pink one right over here. And I'm going to apply some. But let me move a little closer so you guys can see better. No, 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 Guys, I just love makeup so much. It's just, oh, wow. Okay, so this is like a vanity mirror that I'm using because I don't want to mess up. So why am I using the smallest brush? Bruh, am I not thinking right now? Guys, don't you hate it when you poke your eye with the brush and it burns? Oh my god. It's because I can't really close this eye like with this one. And I just poke myself. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see it. My eyes like ah! kind of watery and reddish. What were you thinking? Oh my god. My hey, brother is so annoying. Home. And if I tell him to be quiet, he's going to be like, no. What? You gotta love your siblings, right? Guys, I wish I could just put some music on, but I'm gonna get copyrighted. Like, don't you love that vibe where you're just doing your makeup and you're just like chilling? You know, you're listening to like Kalani and you're listening to like other music that it hits that vibe right there. And ugh, 
I love that vibe. Like, every time I get ready for work, I always do that. Like, I get in, like, a vibe where I'm, like, chill and shit. Because I don't want to go in, like, in a bad mood. Okay, now I need the small brush. Because I need to get the pink over here. And the big brush is not letting me. By the way, guys, the brushes that I am using are from Morphe. You guys can totally go get them. They're actually having a 50% off sale, I think. So, if you guys are actually really interested in Morphe and you guys have been waiting on a sale or something, go, girl. Or boy, go. Go. Go get that. <laughs> okay. And then next, I'm going to be also using this. I don't know if you can see it. It's kind of like a pinkish. And you can use it as a highlight too. I used to use it as a highlight when I didn't have one. So you can also use it as a highlight. But I'm going to use that one for my eyeshadow instead. Okay. Let me actually wipe some of this off right here. I actually use like a wet towel to wipe off the eyeshadow that are on my brushes. <sighs> so it doesn't mess up my makeup. <sighs> And I kind of dab it first so I can just let the, so it's like one of those eyeshadows, so it's like it can show actually. I don't mind getting it on my cheek because it's like a highlight like I told you. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I'm actually just, it actually blends good together. Wow, I never, okay to be honest, I've never actually done this look before. So you guys, I did an account for fitness. Um, since you guys actually been into like fitness and stuff, I actually did a video about it too, like an exercise video with legs and booty. Um, I really guy, I really hope you guys. What the hell, <gasps> guys? Look what happened. <laughs> I mixed it in with the black. What a dump. Okay, ew, that looks so ugly. Okay, hold on. Hold on, guys. I'm just trying to fix it. Now I gotta... Okay. I'm gonna use this. What I was saying about, like, the fitness account. So, about the fitness account thing. It's practically, like, I'm gonna post about, like, foods. I'm gonna post about, like, workout videos, you know. All that. So you guys can be entertained as well. Because you guys have asked me about fitness again. And, you know, I'm gladly happy to do it for you guys. You know, I actually really enjoy fitness. Is not I do it just for like mental health not just for like anything else I actually do fitness for my health and you know I do it because I like it and it's kind of like a stress reliever for me if you can get it if you guys get that thing but you know I actually really like it because it's like a stress reliever oh shit I need to put some more here and you know you should be able to release stress like me I mean you shouldn't be stressing at all in the first point we only have one life to live but you get what I'm saying. So I'm just applying the same eyeshadow colors on this side, just like on this one, you know. And I'm actually really loving the look. Because I don't really like dark makeup with like bright outside kind of thing. <laughs> and I'm just going to apply more of the light pink, not the, the like highlight thing, the highlight pink. Look beautiful. Okay, so I'm not gonna darken my eyebrows too much. I'm just gonna like I'm gonna darken them a little bit, but I'm not gonna do too much to them. Like I'm not gonna go extreme. But you know, cause I also need to go get my brows done and they need to open up because my brows are not looking pretty. Honestly, this is the hairiest that they ever been because I've never left them like this. Like I always go get my nails done every like three three weeks or two sometimes depending how fast they grow and since i do take like collagen and all that crap it makes my hair grow and stuff and yeah naturally my eyebrows are not that much arched i made them arched like not made them but it took me a year to make to have them arched almost a year i think like six months to have them arched because my nails are not, my nails, <laughs> my brows are not naturally like this. 
they're more like kind of like straight instead of like down arch they're like I don't know if you guys ever seen those like brows that are like straight up like this yeah they're kind of like that but I never liked them like that since the face of my shape but so I have them like arched and I'm always gonna keep them arched don't get me wrong like I've thought about like going back to like the straight eyebrows but nah see I'm not gonna do too much I'm just like practically like fixing the brows because the color goes in with it and you know I'm just trying to make them look pretty because I don't really want to do much to my eyebrows because you know a girl likes a natural look and you know I don't feel like doing dark makeup <laughs> okay next I am going to be curling my lashes so I'm gonna use this eyelash curler and I'm gonna just curl them I don't know. What do you guys prefer? Like, not dark makeup or like good makeup but like looks natural? Or like medium? Like in the middle? I actually prefer all of them. <laughs> but I prefer like in the middle more. Like, if I'm going out to like a party or something that's dark and stuff, then I obviously wear dark makeup to show off my makeup. But if it's like bright and sunny like right now then obviously i'm gonna wear well did my camera like on focus like i'm right here dude there you go okay so i actually really like like dark makeup not like i do i like i do but i think for like now that it's sight like sight <laughs> now that it's like sunny and bright i actually really like wearing makeup that actually pops it off like blush with highlight and like the pink eyeshadow you know I, it's like a vibe, like a summer vibe, where yellow eyeshadow, you know, this is the time where you wear those eyeshadow colors. Because when it's winter, you don't be wearing bright colors. Because you usually wear like neutral, like bronze or, you know, something like that. But yeah, I'm going to be using the Fenty Beauty Mascara. Because I love this brand. And I'm going to be applying mascara. I feel like I'm way too far from you guys, but then now that I'm going to look back at this video, I'm like, I could just edit and zoom in. <laughs> Seriously. So, I don't know about you guys, but this is how I apply my mascara. I just go like this, and I press on my lashes hard. Like, I close my eyes hard. And yes, girl, go. What's your guys' favorite mascara brand? Honestly, I don't have a favorite. I do, but then I don't. <laughs> I don't know if you guys get me. Oh, cute butterfly. Oh my god, it just passed by and it's... Oh, it was a pretty cute white butterfly. Oh, guys, I haven't seen butterflies for some reason. That's so cute. I love butterflies. I actually been seeing them and they're actually really pretty they're so pretty especially if it's sunny and everything it shows up more of their wings and all and it's ladybugs oh my god ladybugs are beautiful too I love ladybugs I remember I used to get so scared though when they used to be on me because they used to think they'll fight me or something but they won't they're friendly okay so I usually let them dry I put the first coat on I usually let them dry and then I'm gonna curl them again and apply more. That's what I have. That's how I usually do it. I don't know if that's how you guys do it, but that's how I usually do it if I want my lashes to pop out. So that's what I'm gonna be doing. Some of you know, some of you don't. I usually do this. Like I use my towel to wipe off like the foundation and stuff on my lips, so it doesn't like end up looking really bad or something so i usually just do that i don't even need lipstick it looks like i already have lipstick <laughs> okay so oh, i got some on my finger i don't know what i'm gonna use i kind of really like this lipstick i'm gonna try this one because it actually kind of matches does it oh yes it does
So I try not to apply too much lipstick too if I'm doing like a natural makeup. Okay. And then I'm gonna apply more. This is the finishing look. I actually like this look. I never expected to do this right. <laughs> Since I haven't been really doing a lot of makeup lately. So, yep. A girl cut her hair. <laughs> yeah, I did. I cut my hair and I love it. It's amazing. I feel like a new person. It actually feels so much lighter. And why is it like this? Like, it looks like... Yeah, why is it actually shaped like this? Okay, so I'm actually going to brush it out. And I'm actually going to want to curl it today because it's usually i like it curly but i also like it straight but i like it curly more <laughs> i don't know if you get me i actually really like it curly more and you see how easy it is to brush like oh my god like it's just so so much better okay and i also wanted to show you guys what i got the products that i was using for my hair and I also got this. It's called Monat Studio One, and you guys can look them up. You guys can look them up on Instagram. And why am I looking so freaking pale right now? I am not like that. Um, oh, it's the lighting probably. But okay, don't mind the lighting right now. But anyways, it's called Monat Studio One, and it actually looks like this. This one is a dry shampoo. So all I have to do. So let's say like um, I washed my hair yesterday. But I actually wanted to shower again, but I didn't exercise. I'm going to exercise later. So I'm just going to go like this and spray it. And just make it like if I'm actually showering. Hmm. <laughs> And it smells amazing. You guys, it's, I wish I can freaking spray some right here and you guys, for you to smell it. It smells so good. And there, I also got a conditioner from them too, a Monat conditioner. And the conditioner is bomb. When you get out of the shower, your hair is going to be so soft. And look at my hair right now. I just put the dry shampoo and look how soft it already looks. <gasps> Don't you guys want that? Don't you guys want like soft texture hair? Like, look at this. This is actually so... Oh my god. I've never actually used a dry shampoo. It feels amazing. But, no, seriously. You guys should actually go check them out. And, so, this one is the soothing shampoo. This is the one that I use in the shower, too. I keep them here because I don't have enough room in my shower. I need to buy, like, one of those, like, um, little baskets to put them in. So, I'm waiting on that. But, anyways, this is the shampoo that I use, too. And this is how it looks like. And, it actually makes my hair really soft again like i'm gonna say and it makes like and it doesn't like make it like uh how do you call that um it doesn't i don't come out of the shower with like very like uh wavy hair let's say like uh like my hair is not stuck together like wavy and stuff like that uh, if you guys get me i don't i don't even know if i'm making sense right now but <laughs> anyways and i also have the blow up cream so this one is a blow dried finish so let's say like i came out of the shower and i blow dry my hair and this is what I would have to be using. You know, they are a little pricey, but it actually is worth it because I am not kidding. And this video is not sponsored. I'm telling you just to like let you guys know if you guys have any problems with any kind of hair. Like if you guys want to like, let's say do someone's hair, but you want it to look good and look shiny. And you know, it, this, is, this is actually the products that would actually help with that. And ever since I've been using these products, these products have actually helped a lot with my hair. Um, my hair has actually been feeling really soft. And when I go to work, some some of the girls there are like, wow, your hair is so like shiny and like it looks good, you know? I'm just like, yeah. And I actually recommend them, the Monat. And one of my coworkers actually did look at it and she's like, I'll probably, she's like, I'll definitely buy it because my hair is like really dry and it's not really like working for any product that I'm, for any other product that I'm using. So I told her, you know, go to Monat. You know, you don't have to buy everything. Just buy something. They have different kinds of products for your hair. So if you want, you can buy just one. Wait another next two months, another month. Get another product. 
that's what I usually do with stuff so you know it's actually really worth it and you guys if you guys don't really like showering your hair but you like showering your body and stuff because it's too much or whatever it is I totally recommend the dry shampoo and there's definitely enough you don't need to spray a lot I spray a lot because I like the smell <laughs> but you definitely don't need to spray a lot of this so I hope you guys actually enjoyed this review of the Monat because it's actually really freaking good and I'm not lying to you this time I actually really do recommend it and you know um, the lady that actually recommended it to me is actually one of my she's I, for me she's like an aunt to me like you know she's so nice she actually treats me like if I'm in her own family and you know she's my um, uncle's wife she's just like an amazing person she's actually helped me like a lot with a lot of advice about like business and stuff truly really appreciate her for sending me this stuff as well and you know if I ever run out of this stuff I am gonna buy more because my hair feels so good but yeah I just want to let you guys know that because you know some of you guys have asked me other things you know like what type of product do you use for your hair now that my hair is shiny and stuff and I actually do um, announce it on my Instagram and you know I just wanted to make like a little review about this so you guys can actually see that I'm not lying like look at my hair like if you guys see like a little white is because of my foundation but look at my hair like look how easily like I can move it and look how shiny and look how glamorous it looks like what don't you guys want this hair but yeah it's all the products and you know this is how it actually they all looks like. So if you guys are actually very interested in these products, I totally recommend. Okay, so I'm gonna be using this curling iron and I don't actually do it like this way. I actually like grab it. Is it hot enough? I always try to like feel it like this. Last time, I like got scared because my brother came in and I was like, whoo, and I actually burned myself. But you know, it's all gone now and it's all good. So, yeah. So let me actually put my hair on one side and this one on the other. So I can look amazing. And I can't wait to get my nails done. Okay. I um, look like a little girl with that. Okay. So, I usually just grab like a chunk like this, and I do it like this. I don't know why. See, I don't know if you can see it, but yeah, that's how I usually do it. And I curl my hair. I hope it's hot though. And this is not like a quarantine get ready with me. I just want to show you guys the hair and the makeup look that I'm doing today. You know, just a short little video for you guys. And you know, on my next video, you guys should actually stay tuned for that because I actually have an idea. I don't know it's not a scary idea it's a good idea but yeah so it turns out like this like curly and I don't I left it for too long because it usually doesn't turn out like this I actually just curled the bottom again again so it doesn't look too bad and then I'm gonna grab another chunk I'm gonna put that one in the back I know you guys see one down I'm gonna get that but this is how I usually do it Guys, I want to try sushi. Sushi has been on my mind. I got my dad sushi for like Father's Day, but I don't know why. I just have like, ugh, I just can't eat raw fish. It's like, I can't, it's just like the idea of it like makes me feel like, ugh, you know, like, is it like good? Is it going to make me sick? You know, like, is it really bad to eat raw fish? But you know, I need to try it. I need to be able to try it before I even judge it. So I actually do want to try it. I'm actually going to have one of my good friends take me somewhere to go eat it because i've been wanting to like i want to try the california roll i want to try you know all that and so you know if i can eat sushi with my dad because my dad likes sushi and he's the only one in the family that likes sushi and you know i want to try it so if you guys think i should try sushi let me know actually i should actually do a video about that like the first time trying a sushi like trying a sushi roll or something like that, like a California roll. Hey guys, hold on. My brother's calling me. So I'm gonna curl my hair. As you can see, I'm already doing that. And I'll get back to you to see the finishing look. And we're gonna kinda do a montage kind of look, okay? Okay guys, so I'm totally done with my hair. And I'm planning to put some hoops on, change the shirt, and just let this be free and wavy. 
and yeah. Okay, so this is it. I hope you guys enjoy this video. And if you want more videos like this, let me know down in the comments or just give it a thumbs up and I'll know. Okay, and all my social media will be down below the links and everything, everything that I use, and even the Monad stuff. Okay, so why do I keep saying okay? Like if I'm actually like talking, so okay, 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 so stop. <laughs> Anyways, I really hope you guys actually enjoy this video. Thank you so much for watching. Um, for everything that I have used for my hair, for my face, it will be down in the description everything that I use and all my social media will be down in the description go give it a follow go give it an ad keep up with this girl over here <laughs> keep up with her energy you know okay stop okay I'll see you guys later bye babe